ok <clears throat> mm. now what you're gonna do is we're gonna edit the wall we're gonna edit our wall like here we have a floating wall so we're gonna solve this I go back to a floor plan and the ground floor here then um, so as to change the um, the height or the, the altitude to modify this wall right here we need to cut the wall and look if I select this part here all of the walls are selected and I don't want to change the other wall but only this section S to do so I'm gonna suspend the groups I click <coughs> and like this I deactivated the grouping and now I can select the walls one by one like this one yeah but I just want to change this part here so I need to cut this wall to do so I click on the I choose split then split it here there you go now I can just select this part and I'm going to cut this part here also yep and now I select this wall um, no yep this one and this part there you go then <coughs> in the um, dialog box I'll rise the height at the bottom I'll, I'll give minus 25 okay then we go to F3 there you go now our wall is connected to our slab then here as in our model here we have this wall so I'm just going to um, rise up our bottom wall I go to um, to our floor plan not this this yeah so I'm gonna select this wall this here then I'm gonna rise the height into one meter no 150 okay F3 there you go so um, that is the reason why I have uh, I have risen our 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 column at the beginning there you go okay then now the distance of this here we're gonna lower it I go to the first first floor then I'll create a guideline segment <coughs> from here um, no I'll choose yeah create guideline segment or alt L from here I'll type 170 here so I'm gonna change this wall I right click move drag then put it in here this here there you go and now I'm going to lengthen these walls here 
so I select this wall and I choose adjust and I choose this wall okay then the same for this one I'll adjust the length but this time I'll choose this here there you go then um, this one I'll add more to here yep okay <coughs> F3 to see how it is there you go mm. and um, yeah we'll need to make a slab here I go to F2 I, I go up the upper floor then I'll activate trace and reference I click on it so as to see our reference line at the bottom then here I'll choose um, I'll select our slab I press on shift okay and I click on this green line here the line the edge line of our slab yeah then this menu pops up then I choose offset edge till here there we go but let's just measure alt L I just want to see this distance 115 is okay there you go F to F3 yep there we go and now what we are going to do is we're gonna rise the height of these walls and this here like we have in the picture here these walls and uh, the uh, those here okay so I go to a floor plan first story and I disable the trace and reference so this wall this and this I'll add their height 90 okay then this part I will cut it um, here with the split command I'll click here there you go I select those walls and this I'll add um, 90 F2 F3 there we go okay yeah but I made a mistake this front wa wall doesn't change the height so I can just select it in 3d window just select and I take out this zero okay there we go then um, what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna lengthen this wall and this one I go to F to our floor plan or F2 this one this one I'm gonna add their length 50 50 just type 50 okay the same for this one 50 the 
pressing mouse press by pressing chef shift it's like you activate um, uh, you have the orthogonal method yeah that length then uh, still with these uh, two walls um <coughs> Uh, no, no, I go to yeah, this here. We are going to change to inside face just so as to get it like outside, and the same for this one here inside face. Yeah, F3. There you go. So the aim of that is to get it lengthened and also to have this um, this style here, this design. F2. What I'm gonna do now is. Um, <coughs> We are going to um, no, no, no. We we will do nothing. And now I'm gonna create another slab here. Slab. And in the slab ten. It's okay. I choose a rectangular method. To here, F three. There you go. Okay. Mm. <coughs> and then, um, so, so now here. So we are going to decrease the height of this column and this one. Uh, okay, so this will be um, 620. Okay, there you go. Hmm. And now what we're going to do is draw a slab here I go to um, here I go to here and draw a slab okay then the altitude of our slab I choose this one is 90 orbit there you go okay and now what you're gonna do is we are going to um <coughs> to make a slab here and then um, change the texture of our wall in here like here we have a wood texture 